Ugh, suit her. Do you know how much you're worth? I'm not talking about self-confidence. I mean, if you were literally to sell your body parts, how much do you think you could net? Five thousand. Two hundred grand. One thousand dollars. One billion dollars every year. The reason being, selling organs is illegal in pretty much every country on Earth. So transplant wait lists are to the moon and back. Ugh, suit her. Suit her. How's the framing? Little to the left for me. Hey. Incidentally, do you know how much the average college graduate owes in debt? Basically, what we're saying is we harvest organs and sell them on the dark web to pay off our loans. As in, literally take an organ out of a living person's body and sell it on the internet. Some rich person offers to pay a surgeon for an under-the-table transplant. That surgeon contacts us. Future. Which one is that? How did we get to this point? That one, boy genius! Hey, I'm Apollo. I'm a 21-year-old trans guy, and I studied marketing, which no one told me at the time is the only business major where your job prospects are limited to use car salesman or sign twirler. Don't bother coming back here. I faced a choice between testosterone or paying my loans, and I decided I wasn't going back to bumming tea off of random people from the internet. I find a suitable donor. Desperate working class folks. Road addicts looking to finance their fix? Really anyone with a functioning kidney. This dude's a delivery driver whose son has advanced leukemia. I need you to cut the blood supply to the super renal. The blood supply to the what? The squishy orange thing. Hi, I'm Nava. I was in med school for general surgery. 3.865 GPA, might I add. Until my parents lost their store to changing demographics and storing rent. I dropped out to help support them, but the debt certainly did not go away. I performed an nephrectomy. Sandy. Hey! We need you. What's up? I'm Bowie. Followed the traditional liberal arts degree to barista pipeline, but then my mom... No! We'll never stop us. We'll never go back! Freedom! My younger sister came to live with me, and loans aren't exactly designed for people with dependents, so... I take the kidney to the recipient hospital, telling anyone who asks that it came from some dude who died in a motorcycle accident. I'm busy. Can't you write some kind of program to do that shit for you? What's up? I'm Zandy. I majored in computer science. Yeah! But the industry tends to write off people like me, even though I'm every bit as good a programmer as those other weenies. So I had to choose between not sleeping on a park bench or paying my loans and picked organ trafficking instead. We get paid in crypto and I launder it through our fake coffee business, then divvy up the profits between us four. I'm sorry, it sounded like for a second you were telling me how to do nope, my job. Nope, I would never, I would never, I would never. Then I'll walk out right now. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Paul, calm down. Zandy, grab that ligature and tie off the vena cava, right there. Okay, here's what's gonna happen. I need to stop the bleeding long enough to suture the tear shut. On my account, I need all of you to apply pressure. Is he gonna die? I fucking hope not. You hope not? What the fuck does that mean? Three. Two. One. <laughs> Am I gonna piss blood after this? Cause there's one time I had a kidney stone and my stream was red for weeks. You'll be fine. Just use ice and avoid heavy lifting. At least the patient didn't wake up this time. I thought you had given her the second ketamine dose. Another successful procedure for the body part posse. Complimentary Gatorade? Fruit snack? We are never calling ourselves that. How about the transplant troop? Bowie, can you pass me the cold storage solution, por favor? Why isn't anyone calling me an idiot right now? That's what protects the kidney from ice damage while it's transported. How long can the kidney last? Like, without it? An hour? Maybe two? But also, don't ask me. I've never been in this situation before. How far did you say the recipient is? Montana, so a three-hour flight, plus an hour at the airport, plus two half-hour car rides. We still get paid, right? We still get paid, right? 
I'm not getting paid? Oh, shit. You... You sociopaths! You stole my kidney! Hold on! Like you stole my fucking kidney! I'm... I'm going to the fucking FBI! We were making a game plan! Fuck your game plan! There! Maybe we can ask someone which way he went. Or we can check the public CCTVs. Beep boop, beep boop. Nerd Round shit? Time. That way! Put up, corner him. How about the surgery squad? You could have caught that. It was all you. No. Yo, Neva, you're kind of a badass. Callate. I am not a badass. I'm not a badass. I am a good noodle. Nope. Nope. Fuck no. this. No, Apollo, I'm out. come back. Done. Just think, after this is over, it'll all be worth it. What? Breaking even? Being free of one debt so that I work the rest of my life to afford all the other life shit? I literally just want to watch anime and drink boba and go to quaint little thrift shops with my friends. How did I end up here with some dude tranquilized and his kidney detached from his fucking body? <laughs> ask Bowie! Is it that unreasonable to ask you not to act like a junkyard dog for five seconds? We are fucking professionals. We do not follow our dicks down the street in broad daylight. Professionals think on their fucking feet when shit goes belly up. Oh, I must have missed that class in business school. Which one was it? Uh, assaulting people with ketamine 211? I didn't expect Neva to drug him. Do you know what'll happen to my family if I get arrested? I just saved our shit! Is that what it's called? Look, it's my fuck up, it's mine to solve. I say we tie him down and when he wakes up we threaten him. You know, keep quiet or else... Dot dot dot. Dot, dot, dot? I would rather eat my own ribcage than follow that plan. As the front man of front the man? <sighs> Never. How did we get the cold storage stuff in the first place? Online? But considering we have an hour max until the kidneys porqueria, that's out. And it's not like we could just rob a hospital, so... Wait, 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 no, uh-uh. We are not robbing a hospital. Look, I say so we- So pumping a dude full of ketamine's cool, but you draw the line at petty theft? Not like a major hospital, just like a uh, urgent care. If anything, we're doing them a service by pointing out some shortcoming in their security. Come on, Neva, what happened to teamwork? Yeah, teamwork. As in everyone works together to do what I say. I'll just say that we're there for a supply transfer. And Zandi, this will be the- Save the sales pitch. I'm already in their inventory system. They won't even be able to prove it's gone. No. Out of the question, I'm vetoing it. Bitch, this isn't Congress. If this is what I have to do to be who I am, I'll rob a thousand urgent cares. Everybody in favor? Bye.
Can we speak with the supervisor? That's me. Um, we're here from Cat's Clinic to pick up a transfer of cold storage solution. Do you have our concession papers? Um, remind me of your name again. Karina. Here's the situation, Karina. We're kind of in a rush. There's this kid, little Jessup Honeysuckle. He's seven and unfortunately was born with a rare condition. Cardiomyelosis, which means you work in the medical field. You know cardiomyelosis. Look, there was an accident, someone got killed, and there's a heart ready for transplant. And it would mean the world to little Jessup. Jessup. Little Jessup. We just need cold storage solution. Will you save a little boy's life? Which hospital did you say? Cat's Clinic. Olympic Boulevard, right? See? You know it. Sir, the facility's been closed for two and a half years. Haven't you heard? We uh, just reopened. Uh, new management. The silent alarm's already been tripped. The police is on their way. I don't know what you kids are up to, but I ask you to keep your voices low. Let's send that alarm to patients. Hey, work with me here, Karina. Fuck like this. No, we're not doing this! Make a reckless donation! Not another fucking step! Ah! Hey, what did I tell you? I'm fucking you out. The kidney crew. Kind of on the nose. Don't let Bowie touch it. Shit. Back door. Where? They can't prove shit. Bowie, you literally have pictures of us performing a kidney extraction. Um, guys? There's gotta be a way out.
Did you see them? Which way'd they go? LAPD, drop your weapons! Oh, what the hell? Window. Of course, it never goes that smoothly.